So today Peyton and I are both off work because it is Veterans Day! That's right. So I am actually typically off on Thursday, but I switched today so that we could both be off and go on a hike. So today we drove about an hour and a half from Tulsa straight east towards Arkansas. And as you can tell, we're at Natural Falls State Park. We're going to do some hiking. We brought the boys. They're over in the truck right now. <laughs> but we're going to go see a 75 foot waterfall and then do about know. a mile and a half know. hike or so. Preston is currently getting the dogs ready because we may have forgotten their leashes so he's trying to make shift some so we don't get in trouble and our dogs can come but heads up if you come to Natural Falls State Park so far it's beautiful but you do have to pay to park um, which we were kind of surprised by because we haven't had to do that in the past so it's ten dollars a day but if you have an Oklahoma license plate it is two dollars off so it's only $8 for the day, so not too bad, especially if it's your only expense. So just a heads up if you come here. So we're on Foxton Trail here. It's about a 1.5 mile trail, what they say. Apparently it's got some good elevations to it, some good cliffs that are really nice. So we'll see how it goes, but we're tracking it. We'll see how long it takes us. We're about 0.2 miles in right now. So it should be exciting. Peyton doesn't run into any trees here, but yeah, we'll, we'll see how long this hike takes. We'll keep you posted on what it looks like and we'll do some other video up here. So the rules here at the park are dogs have to be on a leash. So, as you can tell, they're both on a leash, right? Zinky on a leash. All right, go on. <laughs> Don't rotate it like that. Put your weight down, not forward. Oh, nice. Nice. If I go in, you're dead. <laughs> you're doing great, babe. Off of the gram. <laughs> Off of the gram. <laughs> Look, you made it. <laughs> the kids so we can have a little freedom time to ourselves as opposed to trying to get them to heal the whole time which they do a pretty good job but as you can tell they're being crazy okay. running all over the place absolutely loving it okay 
cave is so cool. It has like this 30 foot overhang to it. I don't see any bats though. I wish there were some bats up underneath here. No. Peyton would not like the bats. I don't like critters. <laughs> but it's so cool. We just get to follow it and walk up underneath it all the way down. Or on top of it. Okay, so we have done the Dripping Springs Trail and we went to the observation platform and looked at the waterfall. And then we did Fox Den, which was pretty long and took us over to a fishing area and it was really pretty. And now we're gonna do the Ghost Coon. And I think that's the last one because it's areas that we haven't been to before. Some of the other ones, it'll be kind of like the same trail. So this is the last one for the day. of home and dinner because we're getting hungry but we stopped here at Hudson Lake which is off the highway just for a little scenic reading um, we've started to read this book called vagabonding because we want to start traveling more um, we're starting here locally obviously like today um, but we hopefully, both still have full-time jobs yeah traveling so. around the US and internationally so it just gives like an encouraging perspective of how to do travel and it also gives a good perspective of kind of how to live in the here and now, like be minimalist and know what you need and kind of live your life to the fullest. And it's definitely like experiences over material things. Correct. Yeah, it's more, yeah, it's definitely a life of explore, exploring and not really just being stuck in your box, but yeah, getting outside, seeing new things, doing new things, pushing yourself, getting outside yeah. your comfort zone. All sorts of stuff like that. So it's been an interesting book right now. Uh, yeah. Chapter four. Yeah, and we're just reading it together. Um, we have another book that we're gonna read after this one. Okay. Uh, but we're just kind of reading it together. So it's also good quality time, um, That's true. but also forces us to like learn new things and challenge the way we see life. So correct. So yeah, we're trying to get out of our full time jobs. See if we can start moving around, being on the road. See if we can do internet jobs, which would be nice. <laughs> or if we could pick up something on the side, maybe marketing, it's selling a product. You it's never know. In the air right now. We'll be here a little bit longer, and dinner. Get food. And then probably another 45 minute drive home or so. So it's not too bad. Hey Peyton, where do you want to go to dinner? I don't care. Barn grill. <laughs> Listen. Okay. food camp. I'm very happy. I got the Dalton sliders. Shout out to my brother. You're watching. So really excited. And Preston got a pepper jack burger. Uh huh. Pepper jack burger with fried okra. Got some jalapenos on it, pepper jack cheese, bacon. This should be pretty epic. Have you tried your slider yet? No. With the french fries, good. And they were really good with